surprise guests. <laughs>I just realized I'm not wearing anything underneath. It's amazing how hotels, they have the comfiest bed, the comfiest pillows, but sometimes you just can't sleep because it's not home. I'm gonna go downstairs in the buffet and grab some food. Every time I go to a buffet without Tim, it makes me feel sad because his little face when he sees all the food is so cute. Goodness, guys. I was walking and then something like pricked my foot and I realized it's a piece of glass. Oh, look, I just found another piece on the floor. If I didn't know, I would have probably stood on this. I never really got a chance to show you guys my hair. Um, so this is actually how it looks. I just got a fringe back and um, I cut it a little bit shorter. The color is okay. Um, it's quite similar to my previous color and they were supposed to put ombre in it, but it didn't really show up. Gonna keep my slippers on. Today, I'm actually really excited. The whole reason they flew me over is so I could surprise these girls. These girls who are from different parts of Asia, they also make videos, so we're gonna do a heart to heart. It's definitely something different from what I usually do. For sure, I'm gonna be so inspired by these girls, um, but you know, hopefully I get to inspire them them too and it's just gonna be so nice to see all these girls and you know just to see these faces of the girls that represent you know YouTube Asia. Fit of the day. I can't really see. Okay we'll show here. So I'm just wearing my overalls from Sarah. I have a pink vest uh, top underneath and a pink Prada bag and the nude heels. So normally I would actually wear these of sneakers but um, I guess it dresses it up a little. I guess I'm really pinky and girly today. Usually I would wear like a fitted tank top underneath but I don't really have one so this will have to make do. Thank you to Eliza for picking me up. <laughs> Standing here and I'm supposed to like surprise them but I don't even know if they'll be surprised to see me. Like chances are they don't even know me. Surprise guests! <laughs> The heart to heart was really special to me because it was just such a nice, cozy, intimate session and these girls, they really inspired me. A lot of them are so young but they are already entrepreneurs and I just have nothing but faith in them to know that they're going to go to a lot of far places. So I pretty much just answer some of their questions, just share the common uh, struggles and fears that we go through in YouTube and just how we overcome them. It was just a really memorable day for me because these girls work so so hard and they remain so humble and that is definitely something that we can all learn from I haven't worn these in ages because why would i live in hong kong i never wear heels the only time where it's okay for me to wear heels is when i don't need to do a lot of walking i'll show you guys my outfit for dinner so just nothing special just a ruffle Test blouse with a sort of like a lace lace black skirt and then I got my nude heels I wish I brought my black ones Heart to heart I think I think it went pretty well um, I think what made it really easy was these girls are just genuinely so sweet and oh so young entrepreneurs really really proud of them time to go I'm still trying to get used to the Samsung S6 the camera is pretty darn good I have to say that by the way because sometimes when you're in a lift you get tired I guess everybody's in gowns and everybody looks so um, pretty <laughs> Apparently Gemini's are flirty. Libra and Libra and Taurus. Okay, what about Virgo? Because like my boyfriend, I mean, my husband's oh, a Virgo. Virgo, uh, Virgo is, yeah. Yeah. is it? They're yeah. caring, loyal. Caring, loyal. And it's a, a good uh, provider. Uh, yeah. 
So we're here in, in the <laughs> oh, I thought they were making <laughs> <sorry. laughs> We're gonna be dining in this place. Is this like a shopping center or what is this? Oh, um, nothing like rewinding. Um actually she should have to wake up early tomorrow. But still need some <laughs> still need some time for some Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon. The main point of me coming over is to do just a surprise, um, heart to heart. Now that that's done, they asked if I just want to go visit the Pantene, like the headquarters. So I think it'll actually be pretty interesting. So I thought, yeah, why not? Everybody looks like a sexy doctor, but I just I don't know. I think because I'm so small, it kind of drives me. Hey guys, um, I had to get back a little early because I had some stuff I needed to sort out. So I think most of it is done, but now I'm hungry, so I'm gonna be meeting a friend of mine for dinner. Yes, the Pantan. Do you guys say Pantene or Pantan? But anyways, um, yeah, the the event was. Uh, it's pretty interesting. It's actually my first time. One of the questions I really wanted to ask was um, because I don't know who it was that told me that Pantene they have like wax in their shampoo. I wanted to know if this was true, um, because they said that it coats the hair, so it's really smooth. But when you stop using it, the wax comes off and it gets really dry. But apparently, that's a myth. They don't have wax in their shampoo. Um, but yeah, it was really, really interesting to learn about the science of hair, um, you know, the science they put behind their products. So they gave the girls um, a makeover and a hair makeover as well. So I didn't expect to get one because I thought I'll just like, you know, just go and see what the fuss is. But, um, you know, I actually had my makeup done, which is quite pretty. My goodness, guys, today I met someone with the most unbelievable skin I've ever seen. Like, <laughs> she's called Perry Pie and she's a really, really talented um, makeup artist. And um, yeah, her skin is just, when I saw her, I was like, oh, come on, because I couldn't see her pores. You know, sometimes you, you can just get so dazed. So like, there's some moments I was just like. I'm here in this place um, that's famous for, what's it famous for? Bakate. Do you want to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Haitian. I didn't want to like have like um, room service like oh it'd be really nice for me to finally meet her because like I mean, we've been tweeting back and forth but like we never really had a chance to meet basically this is a pork rib and um it's in a peppery sippy yeah. I thought it'd be really chewy but it's really soft don't you think intestines like like poo goes through it, you know? <laughs> but I think they wash it, right? <laughs> I'm sure they, hopefully there's no poo in there. <laughs> 